when we got all the chrome and everything put on the car and I'm looking at the details, this chrome line actually stepped down right here and then lined up up in the front. I didn't like the way that that line had a step in it, so I actually shortened the chrome and we're gonna add some glass to the door itself. So this part will actually look like it's just sitting on top of the door and it'll line up with the radius of the chrome trim around the windshield. So that'll be one line as it comes around. It's a little tiny detail, but those are the things that get away from the little hiccups of production and make it a one-off car. Freddie, you see this little hole right here? Oh yeah, we were gonna pull it off afterwards, okay. right? Okay. Yeah. Absolutely. So if we're going to lay that up first and that side together, and then we mm -hmm. pull it apart, we'll reinforce okay. that little piece there. Perfect. That fender, if you look at it, see it goes, and it's hollow oh. right through here. Then it gets round again. See it? Oh yeah. With the molding, you can't. That's that's why I was thinking of pulling them off because this shows. It stands out more, right? Mm -hmm. And if we did that to the peak of the, then it would kind of bring it up. I mean, see it. Yeah, it needs to need go by the bit through there a little bit, yeah. The, the molding looks like it does that. Yeah. Did you get a panel mod sucked it down? No, I, I think this side, remember we were always fighting something on this side. Look at this side. Yeah. So it's part two. Yeah, it's That's why I was the thinking of pulling them off. Because I was fitting them and then I realized, holy smokes, you got those big. I wonder if we could lift them and put something like, you know, to give it that shape without having to do a lot. So. Cause it's not bonded there till farther back. The bond is way back here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's way back here. And that's probably why it's sucked in right here, huh? Cause for the bond is to here, from here to here, it drops. Mm -hmm. So maybe we could try it just, you know, if we, if we jack it up a little bit and then warm it up and then oh, glass it. The glass. Uh -huh, and glass it and let it cool down. We, we might get that shape back. Cause you can always shape this again to this, right? So mm -hmm. we can try it without spending a lot of time on it. See yeah. how yeah, it looks. I had noticed it. I but you see before. it. Yeah, we had not uh, especially with the molding. When I was fitting them the first time, I didn't finish it because I wasn't have done Especially with uh, the molding, you can see it. It's, weird. it's real round right here, which on both sides, yeah. it gets real round right there, which makes this look all over yeah, both sides. And that's what it is. It's right where the end of the, that's where that is. Yeah. Firewall. That's weird. Yeah, it's right where the inside is. Right, you can see it right there. Yeah, otherwise we'd have to reshape it all with filler or something. Mm -hmm. All right, so we'll, maybe we'll try that a little bit. We can fill these holes. All these. Oh, right where the yeah. molding used to go. So you're not putting that one. No, we're not going to put that piece back in. Okay. What I want to do is paint that silver and put chrome tape in it and clear over it. So it'll look like a piece, but it's going to fit. Oh, I got it. Like it was the back holding. Yeah. And then what I want to do is make something that fits in this little flat here. You just take that right. one. That one. It'll finish. So you would have the actual trim would be, you can do chrome or yeah, whatever you want. Make a piece right? and yeah. just paint it black and it. we'll drill some holes and probably put some studs on it and it'll just fit in there. I could make those pieces first. If you want. Well, I was going to say you could make those and I'll mold everything to fit that, right? Yeah. So we'll have these. That'll go in first. Mm -hmm. These can go in. Yep. And then they'd come out the same way and then we'll fill the yeah, filler it towards it. looks like it's open. Right, right. Oh, yeah. It looks like a brake cooler, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, good. Okay. So we can get rid of this as well, too. Just yeah. transition it. Make it that radius and come out with it. Right. Oh, that's good. Cool. So if you get us those, then we'll just keep okay. going with those. After mm -hmm. we ourselves cover that. What's the wax for? Put your back glass. Are putting wax on? Uh, wax off, actually. Oh. Uh -huh. No. Yeah, I'm putting wax on the. Leaving glass behind it. Mm-hmm. Oh, stick it. Well, wax. Yeah, it's fiberglass from this side, and it just peels off, and it's kind of just like smooth.
This one's really it's close oh, to wow. the edge. Get you one of your sweeps on that, huh? That would be really sweet. How sweep it is. Guys, you guys know what Freddy's wearing right now? Isn't that a nice looking suit? Who are you wearing? Okay, now, huh? <laughs> Three hours. <laughs> and we have Freddy walking out on the red carpet. I just three am. I told he left his N95 accessory at home. <laughs> <laughs> you got your uh, quarter inch, half inch. Quarter inch, half inch? I'm sorry, half inch. You got your half inch. Half inch. We'll just open it up mm -hmm. and keep an eighth inch gap there. Sure. You could take the template from here and then see how it fits there and then just copy it like that, right? Trim it first or whatever. This is pretty, pretty this is a too lot much softer, right? right? right. This is pretty kind of sharp. Yeah, if you find a good area, like it looks like this is bumpy, but this is straight, so if you find that one, you can probably carry it out, right?
So this is a trick that most guys most guys don't know and can't do and don't get a good outcome because they don't know it. And the reason why they don't is because it looks like you would never do that. Why would I put that much bondo on top of it? So it's kind of a double edge. That's why they don't do it. But I found out that it's, it's all right to do that much bondo if you prep it and get it right. It works good. But for most bikes, it's like, wow, I can't believe you're putting that much bondo on something. So it's kind of... Okay, let me ask questions because I figure I can't be the only one that doesn't know. <laughs> no, everybody wants to know. Here? Yeah. I'll probably be the only one here that doesn't know, but <laughs> not out there. No, and that's why I'm telling you this stuff because you know that most of the guys don't. You have to see it somewhere in a specialty shop to pick up some of the stuff, you know? Straight, straight, straight one, and I kept your little bend. So I'm gonna give, yep. get us a straight, okay. and then I'll get the straightness to it. And that this is a little crooked. Mm -hmm. That one is straight, so I'm gonna put that piece over here and straighten it, it out too. Okay. So we've got a yeah. If you make form. that nice and smooth, right. then when we bolt the strap down, we'll put some tape on this. We we'll bolt it down, then we'll block those straight. Okay. So that's what I was figuring. That one because yeah, those straight. those have a lot right. of ripples in them, and the edges too. So that is straight too. So I'm going to put those straight mm -hmm. on there, and I saw that that straight will give us both straight on both on this side and this side, okay. and then then I can tell you to put that on top. This yeah. has a band on it. If you put it on, it's right here. You'll oh, see, right? So I think, and I checked it from the other side. You can get rid of it by following that one that I've got. See how it kind of comes this way a yep. little bit, and that one doesn't. Yeah, we'll straighten this right, out. Right, so I'm going to give it that flap and then we'll just mm -hmm. bend it afterwards. I don't want to mess with any of it myself because it's changing it. But you want to see how it fixes? it? <laughs> Come over here. Come, oh, oh. I'm sure. It's really easy. <laughs>
There you go. Yeah. Pretty simple. That's good. And so the reason why it was like that is because it was like that before. The holes are there, so I'm gonna yeah. have to fill the holes and move the holes over. Okay. So that's right. That's good. Yeah, that's good. Perfect. And then I'll get the line straight, and you can help me with the side, or you say yeah. we'll block it on top we'll of it afterwards. Them. Yeah, once they're on. That's right. Very good. We'll just finger tighten, hold them down, and then we'll. And then how would you do the sides? You know, because it does do a little bit too. We'll block those too. Block those two yeah. first. All right. So then I need to leave that side the way it needs to be, and this can mimic that, right? Yeah. Afterwards. We'll sand these, block them, and we'll probably make a uh, piece of metal to bolt these two. Oh, these two. So we can keep blocking them. Yeah. All right. Good. And then when Greg coppers them, we'll block the copper until they're straight. So you'll have that fixture already yeah. to block the copper. Let's take this off. Did your... Uh... I got those pieces in there. Yeah, they worked, huh? Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> you said they never work. Can I see that? Is that out loud? <laughs> Hmm? <laughs> the back piece. <laughs> the glue's not dry yet. That's what I want right there. Oh, sweet. Cool. Yeah, okay. Good. So the other side so should we be need the same. I know, it's kitchen mm -hmm. with the other side right here. So we can shave it and prime it too. Yep, so we put it there and we'll see where it gets to the rest of the car. Yeah. Looks like it needs to go move it forward. Yeah. That's all we need. So it's a nice line. to replace it so we can put that hole oh, in. Oh, right. It's definite. But yeah, see that looks good there. So now just when it's closed, because this doesn't look good here, right? There's something. There's no left right, so just yeah. right there. That's, that's it. So what do you think we should do that with that? So it doesn't look thin and then thick and thin, you know? Just make it the same. Make it the same, right? It's yeah. okay if we take a little bit off of it right there, like the one eighth on the inside. Just I was worried that you'd see inside of it. Yeah. That's fine. It's okay. Yep. We'll just make a nice, it looks like it could probably come down a little bit right there. A little bit lower. This way. Right. And a little but bit of a radius like that, good. right? Just yeah. a little bit. So it'll be the same here, same here, but just take that little meat off. Yeah. Okay. That's good. Cool. And then we'll add that. Gosh, my front hole seems like it's too small. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know where that's gonna end up in this video.